I'm going to test the new test cam, uh, the DR07XP. It's the 2025 version of this recorder. It just came out uh, a few weeks ago. It started showing up on Amazon. I'm going to test the uh, RF interference with it, uh, just the radio frequency interference that the old one had. Yeah, it's a lot of times you're out recording and you get near power lines. Uh, Wi-Fi routers, that sort of thing. It can cause interference. Even your phone like this can uh, give you some interference. It can be distracting in the video and the audio recordings are downright just ruin them completely. So I'm going to check with phone, uh, camera, which people put these on top of cameras a lot, uh, a few things around the house and uh, take it outside and check it out really good. Uh, so I sort of cut away on the video to make it as short as possible, but I just want to see if this is going to be any better, have any better shielding than the uh, older one did, and uh, make for better audio recordings with it. So let's give it a shot. Just start the recording. Um, this I have on airplane mode and off right now. Uh, turn it on. Just holding it near the recorder. I'll turn airplane mode off um, where it'll use 4G, 5G, and uh, also the Wi Fi. See if it gives it any interference here. Gonna try uh, putting a camera near it. This is just one of my Sony cameras. Um, a lot of people will mount this right on top of the camera, and uh, it's just basically touching the camera just about and I've got this I'm gonna turn it on and um, you can see now whether it's giving any interference on it turn it on here it boots up should be able to see at the top here it'll tell you um, that it's got on Bluetooth and Wi-Fi turned on so see if there's any differences now sit on top of the camera. Turn it back off. I'm gonna go uh, check a few things around the house. Try it near this Wi-Fi light bulb. Drug the recorder pretty much all around the house, um, held it over computers, um, some other devices near the refrigerator, that sort of thing that gives off a little interference from time to time. Um, my house has uh, a lot of Wi-Fi uh, connections like um, things that operate uh, lights, uh, different plugs, things like that, and it doesn't seem to be getting any interference from that. Um, the only thing that I've found at all is um, when I get close to the Wi-Fi router and when I get close to um, one of my security uh, hubs on it that re holds all the recordings, um, that's got a Wi-Fi base that it runs off of. Those are the two items that set it off at all that I got any interference. I walked out back. Um, it was super windy outside, so I didn't uh, use any of those audio recordings because it was really tough, even with the uh, 
putting a dead cat on top of it. But uh, I got near a transformer, had no problems with that. Stood under some power lines near the end of my driveway and near a, a light pole. Uh, didn't seem to get anything from that at all either. Uh, so it seems to be shielded a lot better than the first version. The first couple of versions on it would tend to pick up a lot of stuff, even just your phone near it. But uh, the things that give you the most troubles, probably holding it near other microphones, holding it near your uh, camera or a, a phone uh, that you'd need to worry about, uh, as long as you stay at least about three feet away from uh, any type of hub or uh, like your modem, that sort of thing. Uh, you should be okay. shouldn't really give you any trouble. It was, it was really before I got to within three feet of those, and those put off a really strong signal that I had uh, any issue at all with it. The uh, camera is uh, something that a lot of people would really worry about. The old one, the one before, if you put it on top of your camera, uh, it could cause some clicking and bumping noises if you had the Wi-Fi on Um most people would leave that off uh, to alleviate that at all, but at least you know you can still have it on and have stuff transferring and it not interfere with the new one. So pretty much goes to show this is shielded a good bit better. Uh, anything close to those, holding it close to the uh, Wi-Fi router and modem combo, um, you're going to get some sort of interference with it. So it looks like they really improved it a good bit. Uh, I don't see any issue with it recording out in the wild. It does as good as any of the other recorders that I've had over the years. So um, i probably recommend this with uh, not have any issues with it. So if this helped you out at all, please uh, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.